everyone! So, after going shopping last weekend, I decided that I was going to make fabulous finds into a series. Uh, I went to Lomans and Filene's and picked up a couple of things, and I also got my an order shipped from Zoo Shoes. So, I'm just going to go ahead and show you what I got, and I'm going to give you all the prices as well as the original prices, um, so you can kind of compare. Okay, so first for the shoes, I got these shoes from a website called Zoo Shoes, and I'll include a link down below. Um, but they basically, they sell everything from um, really, really inexpensive, just everyday sandals, um, but they also have a lot of Steve Madden shoes at a discounted price. Um, and so the two pairs that I got are some of the really cheap flats. So the first pair looks like this. It's kind of gladiator inspired and it has a little tiny heel. This is a one inch heel and it's made by bamboo. Oops, that's upside down. It's made by bamboo. Um, and I believe that both of these shoes were around $15 each. So I'm not entirely sure of the price, but I think these might have actually been closer to $13. But um, I will say I was a little disappointed when I got them because these detail, the gold detail on it, looks a little bit cheap, but I think that from far away nobody will notice and also people just don't really examine your feet that closely and I'm looking at it from, you know, right here. So this is the first pair and I just really liked the buckle here and then the little buckle there. And then the other pair I got I like much better. It looks like this and again it has a little tiny heel and it has these this beautiful detail right here which does not look cheap at all, and I love it. Um, and these are by Delicious. And again, about $15, I'm not sure of the exact price. Um, they also zip up in the back, which is really, really cute. So, both just good, simple sandals for summer. Everything else I got in this haul is either from Lomans or Filene's. Um, and basically, these stores are kind of like department stores, except they have all kinds of different name brands at very discounted prices. So um, I picked up a pair of Sevens jeans, they have True Religion jeans, Page Premium Denim, Joe's, all those kind of brands. Um, and then they also, they usually carry the brands that I look for. They have Free People, they have Juicy, so all different kind of brands. They also have higher end brands like Michael Kors and they ca carry Ellie Tahari suits. The first thing I picked up was a pair of sunglasses. They look like this and these are made by Betsy Johnson. And I got these. These are from Filene's. So these were originally 55 and I got them for 20. So you can tell big savings. Um, and they're really cute. They have little rose detail on the side and then little hearts on the end. So, good pair of sunglasses for summer. Um, I picked up two shirts. The first one's just plain crop top. Nothing really special about it. I wish there had been a pocket on it. I really would have loved that, but that's okay. Um, so... This is by American Apparel, so that's another brand that Lomans typically carries. And it was originally $18, and I got it for $10. The next thing I got was a sweater, and I know it's getting to be summer, and you're thinking, crazy, why would you buy a sweater? But um, I just decided where I was going to go to college, and I'm going to be attending Indiana University. So it's going to be cold the majority of the time. So I figured that was a good excuse for buying a sweater. So this sweater is also kind of another staple. It's made by French Connection. And it has big pockets on the side. And also really nice buttons. And this I actually got even more discounted. So you can see it was originally $88. And then it was re reduced down to $40. And then it was in the 50% off section, so I got it for only $20. So $88 to $20. So they also have a lot of sections like that, which I know can be daunting for some people because it's so overwhelming. They just have racks and racks of clothing. 
but if you take the time to go through the racks, often you'll find little gems like that and get them really, really cheap. I had a friend that actually went, searched for hours, found a pair of jeans for $6, and they're her favorite jeans now. So, the next item I got was from Free People, and it looks like this. It's a really baggy t-shirt, and I loved the eagle on it, and of course it had a pocket, so of course I loved it, and then it has really pretty lace detailing down the sides, and I've already taken the tag off this because I've already worn it, but here's the tag. So it was originally $68, and I got it for $30. So, um, next I got some, I picked up some denim, and these stores are usually really good for carrying denim. Like I said, they carry all different brands of jeans. Um, they don't often have that many options for shorts, but occasionally you find something. So the first thing I picked up is this denim mini skirt. And it's nice because it's long enough that it doesn't look inappropriate, but it still hugs your curves. And it has this really cute zipper on the side. Um, and this is made, I'm not sure how to pronounce this, by Les Alice. Looks like that. And so this was originally $88 and I got it for $35. And then I picked up a pair of shorts. This is one of the only pairs of shorts they had out. Um, and these are made by Free People. As you can see, this is their signature button. Um, it has studs all down the side, like this, which I really like. Uh, and then this pair I was lucky to find because I don't know if it was a factory defect, but it actually wasn't as distressed as the other pairs were. So it still looks pretty normal you can see some of the distressing but because I don't I'm not really into buying the whole it looks like my jeans have been worn for a couple of years um so these were originally $78 and I got them for 30 and then the last thing that I got was a new pair of jeans so they're just regular skinny leg jeans um, these are sevens, so seven for all mankind, you can see, in there, and these are just the skinny, if you're wondering what style, and I love these so much, they're my new favorite pair of jeans, they're so stretchy, they almost feel like they're made out of spandex, but they still look like jeans, which is amazing, um, and so these jeans, I've already worn them, so I took the tag off, but they're originally $165, um, reduced down to 99 and then I had a coupon for $20, $25 off if I spent $100. So I actually got those jeans for $75 and they were originally $165. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I'll include a link to all the websites for all the stores that I mentioned in the bar below. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.